I'm always, always surprised and impressed by how observant you guys are. You guys who watch these vlogs, how observant you are of small little details in the videos. Since Lucy and I got these phones, we got new phones recently, a few weeks ago, been loving this. It's the Samsung S21 Ultra. Um, since we got these, we've just been kind of using them in the background of vlogs, haven't really mentioned it in the vlogs. So, so many comments, what phone are you using? You guys both have new phones, how is it? So today I want to start off the vlog talking a little bit about this. We're actually working, so happy to be saying this, we're working with Samsung, one of our favorite brands, and we've been using the new phones for probably over a month now, I would say. Super happy to be working with Samsung. I've actually put together a small video which I wanna share with you. I'm super proud of it. It tested a lot of my skills and it was fun to put together, especially in lockdown. And it goes through a few of my favorite features of this phone. So I'm gonna share this with you this morning. Huge thanks to Samsung for working with us on this. So hope you guys enjoy this little video quickly. At the start of this vlog, leave a comment, let me know what you think. I've been using the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra 5G phone for a couple of weeks now. It's kind of the perfect phone for everything I do. I'm gonna mention some of the features. As a vlogger and a content creator, this phone is really helping me make everyday moments that much more epic. I can quickly capture moments from my day in a ton of different ways. There's a multi-camera on this phone to capture moments in high resolution. You've got a 108 megapixel lens for wide angle shots. You can also zoom out even further. You've got an ultra wide lens of 12 megapixels and a 40 megapixel front camera for those all important selfies. This phone records 8K video. To have this in my pocket when I'm traveling, when I'm at the beach, even when I'm just at home or around the city here, to have this high quality video is so, so useful for me to incorporate into my vlogs. And if there's any moments within that video that I wanna capture and keep, I can take a high resolution 33 megapixel screen cap of that moment and upload it to Instagram, for example. Director's view allows me to use the multiple cameras at the same time whilst I'm recording so I can capture a close up. I can come further back and get different angles using the different lenses within the same video clip. As I think you can already tell, it's the camera on this phone that is setting it apart for myself. There's a feature called Super Steady. Every shot you take is stabilized and this even works when you're using the space zoom. The 30 times zoom, it stabilizes the shot you're trying to take even at a distance. And I tried this the other day. If you need to get in even further, this camera has a hundred times zoom, which is just insane. Would I recommend that? Yeah, I would definitely recommend this phone. It makes everything I do on a day-to-day -day basis that much easier, the quality's great, and this really is my new all-in-one device for everything that I need to do. So as you can see, I've been really enjoying the new S21 Ultra by Samsung. Order yours now at authorized Samsung stores or at samsung.com. I'm proud of that, I'm proud of that video. Good morning guys, starting off with the morning coffee. Oh, it's so good, oat milk flat white. I was speaking to so many people who are starting to make the switch to oat milk and I've been babbling on about this in the vlog for over a week now, but honestly, I'm getting to a point now where I can't tell the difference anymore. It just tastes like a delicious flat white. We've been, oh, it's gone. I was about to say we've been using the Arabica beans again. It's in the bin. <laughs> It's sticking out the bin because we only bought a small bag. We've run out of coffee beans, so we're gonna have to make that a mission for today. We're also gonna have some condo talk today. You may have seen the title of today's video. Um, yeah, we need to talk about that. But we hope you guys are all doing well. Let us know in a comment where you're watching from. We've been doing these live streams on Facebook. We've been asking people where they're watching from in the world and there are viewers of our videos, of our content from ev everywhere. So, so many places. I can't even begin to start listing them off. It is insane that so many people from around the world tune in to our stuff, to what we're doing. We don't take it for granted. We're hugely, hugely grateful. And we know as things start to change in some countries with restrictions and stuff, we just hope everyone's staying safe. We hope everyone's staying positive and happy. And if you can start to see your friends and family then, then that's amazing. There's people who are starting to see uh, friends and stuff who they haven't seen for over a year. I'm seeing a lot of content at the moment of people meeting up with friends I haven't seen for a long time. In, in the UK, you can go to a pub garden now and some shops have started opening. So. I really, really hope this is the start of the world going back to some kind of normal or new normal. And just as I said that about the coffee beans, our good friends at Ellipsis Coffee, which is these guys, some coffee beans that we really like. They're from Antipolo, very close to Manila. Um, he just messaged me say, hey George, I've got some coffee beans. I want to send them over to you. Timing, man, timing, that is, that is awesome. So we'll try some Ellipsis Coffee later on. I'll show you when they arrive. Breakfast is coming together nicely. We have our classic sourdough toast. 
Yum. Beautifully cooked with some olive oil in the pan. We then have some hard boiled eggs. Well, actually, they're six minute cooked I like your eggs. makeup today. Thanks. Oh, yeah, hi. I mean, the whole Lisa. outfit. Thanks. I, I like it. Nice, chill, but comfortable, but looking good. Thanks. You're welcome. Blue and blue. That was a thought process. You're welcome. This outfit would suit you, actually, because you If you ever want a eyes. compliment, come to me. Me? Yeah. Deal. I didn't know what to say then. <laughs> I'm speechless. <laughs> Same for you, though, obviously. Do you want a compliment? Yes, please. I like your hair. Thank you very much. That's right. Um, so we have some eggs here. This is called an egg, and we put it in the pan for... <laughs> Put it in the pan for six minutes and that's how we get it. Well, I'll put it to the test. We'll see. I'm saying it as though I definitely know it's going to be perfect. Sometimes it isn't. It depends if I put it in when it's boiling or a bit before or after. So we'll see. I mean, this looks pretty good so far. If it's really wet and runny now, we know it's too runny. Um, but usually if it's solid on the outside, it's going to have that like half and half middle. It has a name, but I don't remember. What's the name of that? When it, an egg's like cooked a bit, so it's gone a little bit powdery, but it's also still got the runny inside. Soft boiled? Soft boiled, yeah. Medium boiled? Medium, medium oh, rare. Man. I don't know, oh this looks perfect actually because you've still got like the little soft bit in there. Um, we've also got a delivery from, oh, we need to start knowing how to pronounce this. Is it Arete? Arete. Arete. Definitely. I think so, yeah. Arete, be your best self. This is the um, juices that we've been having. We had like a whole week of doing them last week and they're great, they're really, really good, all natural. With food as well, some people ask like, are you just having juices? No, this is all alongside um, our usual diet, our usual meals that we have every day. Um, but it's just packed, filled with vegetables and some fruits and some really good stuff. No water, no preservatives, no sweeteners, nothing What's in like this that. One? This is cucumber, apple, ginger, lemon, parsley, spinach, and mint leaves, and it's the one that we find tastes the best. And so we've got a glass of it each here, and we're just excited to have another week of juices because it's just so it feels so good, doesn't it? Yeah, I mean, totally. We mentioned in a vlog the other day that we're having this as well, so we'll have that later. We're just Packing in the greens, guys. If it's green, it's usually good for you. So just eat as many green things as you can. Is anything green that's not good for you? Oh yeah, and also I've made uh, a coffee here. We've been having iced coffee. This is in a double espresso with some water, with some ice cubes, and then just adding, well, I like it iced more than hot, the oat milk. Mm. So I just add a bit of the um, oat milk to it. Not too much. Yum. That looks, that looks great. Tastes really good it as well. Tastes, it almost tastes like a Bailey's or something. It's so creamy and nice. So nice. But um, I need to just piece, finish piecing breakfast together and I'll show you guys the finished result in a sec. I just burnt myself picking this up. I touched the pan. Let's try this. Celery. If it's mainly celery, I actually don't mind celery juice. I can drink raw. There's no celery in it. Oh, I thought you said celery. That's a cucumber. And like cucumber. A There's no celery. <laughs> oh, that's a really good one. Some of these are kind of like, Okay, I know this is healthy. I know this is good for me. I'll get through it. Doesn't taste great. This tastes really good, this one. Now, what I'm about to say on the vlog is a little bit of a risk because the internet is the wild west. The comments are an open discussion and this could backfire terribly. But Lucy and I have just started watching Line of Duty. I know, we're late to the game. We're late to the game. We've started Line of Duty from season one. We've actually already watched all of season one and we're now on season two. Really enjoyed the first one. I know a lot of people are watching it. It's all over Twitter. I think the new series has got a lot of attention. So please guys, please, I don't think no there's spoilers. Too many spoilers because true, we don't know all the characters in the future the series. Season. That's true, but please no spoilers. Don't be that person. No one likes that person. No one respects that person. No one thinks that person's cool, funny, intelligent. <laughs> anyway, we enjoyed that. That's what we're watching on Netflix. As always, we invite you to leave your recommendations down. We're still in lockdown, so we need stuff to watch. We need stuff to go into our brains. We need stimulus. We need entertainment. We need to be consuming content through a screen because that is the way of the world these days. So yeah, movies, imagine seasons, imagine get them in. Lockdown in like 1920. Imagine lockdown in 1920. Probably be good, you just light a candle, you would <laughs> read the local, I don't know, did they even have, yeah, they had papers, right? You'd yeah. read the paper, Listen, you would. Did they have radio? No, not yet. Radio was kind of late, a little bit later on, wasn't it? The wireless, they had music. If you had a trombone in your house, then you, uh, you you could be entertained for a long time. Do you know what I miss? Barbecuing. I really miss barbecues. I never did a bar. I did actually. I did used to help. 
If my family, so if my family would, long. it's not a lie. If my family would have a barbecue, I'd be the one who helped. I'd be the one who did. I wouldn't like to be the one who cleared up, but I did like to be the one who helped. I think I'm saying that because a lot of people in the UK now, some other vloggers we're watching and stuff, are starting to have barbecues because you can now in the UK invite people into your garden. That is now allowed. You can meet up in your garden, and yeah. If you guys want to see more from us, make sure you're following our Instagram pages on the screen now. All right, guys, just got a delivery from downstairs that I said was being sent earlier. Check this out. Look at the branding on these, man. Ellipsis Coffee Anti Polo. Pan is it's got Panolo on it. Song, right? Is it? Yeah. Is it? This branding is so, so cool. Like a kind of comic strip along this. That's awesome. Thanks so much, guys. I've kind of actually finished the coffee for the day. Oh, I want to smell it. All right, I'll open this and smell it because I'm going to use these tomorrow. Okay, just got a little hole. Oh, what? Oh, wow. That's not loose. Smell this quickly. Wow, smells amazing. How does that smell? We'll use those tomorrow. Huge thank you to Ellipsis Coffee. I'll leave their Instagram on the screen. We used their big bag of beans in one of the previous lockdowns and it got us through. And we've tried a few of their different ones as well. And wow, if there's anything to go by, the smell. Love the branding as well. Thank you, guys. They are definitely one of our favorite local coffee companies. Check out this one as well. More cool branding. And what is this? This Whoa. is an ice cream. We need to get this in the freezer because it's been sat downstairs. Not for too long. Not this for is too the long. company name. Kura, Kurimu. Kurimu. It's a Japanese um, style of ice cream. It says, we hope you enjoy a handcrafted small batch ice cream. May each unique flavour transport you momentarily to Japan. At least through your palate. Sounds incredible. Oh, wow. The flavours look unreal. Um, I think they're available in like Grab and Food Panda and stuff. But I sent these over just now. How many tubs? Is this six tubs? I think so. Oh, wow. I love the branding. Look at the branding. How cool oh, is that? That's so nice. So we've got Shoyu Caramel. Wow. We've got Kinako Vanilla. I love how simple but satisfying this that looks. Is super Isn't satisfying. it so nice? It looks like high end, doesn't yeah, it? Super high quality. Black sesame. I'm very excited about this one. I love sesame stuff. Oh, cool. Um, let's open this one. I think we've got enough room in the freezer. I hope so. What we'll do is, before this vlog ends, I feel like having some of this tonight. Yeah, definitely. We will do a little taste test of this because we haven't tried it yet, but I'm very excited to try it. We always give honest reviews of things that we get sent. Okay, this one, I'm not allowed to show you yet because this vlog is going on today, but tomorrow they're launching a new flavor and you'll have to check out their Instagram page. But I think it's gonna be a very well-liked flavor, but it's currently, I can't show you guys, I'm not allowed under to. under embargo. It's, I've got to keep it a secret until tomorrow. And this vlog's going on today, so. <laughs> wow, look at the look at the color of this that. This is azuki, which I think is a red bean flavor. And then lastly, we have the Kinako chocolate. So wow, oh, so I nice. just I'm obsessed with how they look. I cannot wait to try them. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Very kind. Six. That's three each. Three tubs each tonight then. Brilliant. Perfect. All right, nice. Lucy just came up with a genius idea. Lockdown's been a bit different this time. I don't know why. It's been screwing with our minds a little bit more than before. Um, so we're gonna go for a walk now because I think that is something that we should definitely do. We haven't been out today, we haven't left the house. You need to help yourselves in these situations. So Lucy suggested that we try the ice cream now, which I'm very happy about. So we're gonna try the walk. We're gonna try some ice cream, talk to you guys about the condo. Basically, a lot of you guys have been wondering Can on- I pause you? Yes. What ice cream would you like? Oh, you choose, just surprise me. Oh, no, I fully trust you. Okay, chocolate. Okay. Thank you. Uh, so, Lucy and I have been asked a lot. We've seen it in comments, we've seen it in messages, on live streams, people have been commenting and asking what's happening with the new condo, when are you guys moving in? And as always, why is it that the most commonly questions that we get asked, we don't really know the answer to? We basically not, are not sure when we're moving in because of the lockdown, because of the ECQ that we just had, and now we're in an MECQ, we couldn't move. We couldn't move in. The building kind of stopped any new move-ins. However, we do now have a date for when the construction, it's not even construction. We went around, and if you saw in the vlogs a few weeks ago, we went around and did kind of like a, a checkpoint. Any paint splashes, any small cracks, anything that's like a little bit wonky. One of the light switches was slightly off. Small things like that, a few scratches on the windows. They're fixing all these things. I think it got delayed during the ECQ, but we do now have a date for when the construction is finished and it's not too far away. Yeah, so however, however, 
the building is now still not allowing any move-ins, but we technically already have the keys so and the parking yeah, place, so, and we own the place, so we kind of, it's not like a fresh move-in, we just, we own it already, and we've, we've been in out a few times. <gasps> Phone call! Oh, hello, could you please leave it in the lobby? Yes, please, thank you very much. Thank you, bye. So many deliveries recently. We will be there eventually. The last thing we showed you guys was putting that green paint on the wall. That's gonna still be there. I wonder what it will look like now. Peeled off. Yeah, we're so, you guys saw the excitement on those vlogs where we last spoke about the new place. We're so excited to get it, there. It really, we know a lot of you are waiting for it. We're waiting for it. It really felt like it was all happening. We went to, um, we went to Home Depot, we got the table and chairs, we got the paint. It was all like this big build of excitement. I know. It's, it's still it's on, the on the balcony. It's just yeah. sat there. I hope, I hope the wind oh hasn't blown God. it off. But honestly, <laughs> if if you see like Venice Mall um, has been damaged by a table and chairs, you know it's no, our fault. It's, it, um, wouldn't, it wouldn't fly off, it's <laughs> no, too heavy. No, I'm joking. But yeah, we were all excited and we had this like big build and it was all happening and it was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Power through, like this is it. And then it was like, stop. Everything, Everything stopped, stopped. And we couldn't do anything. Oh, we have got one more um, photo, 3D render from Elba. Let's share this with you. We'll put it on the yeah. screen now. Check this yeah. out. Check this out. How it's cool is so that? Nice. So it's basically the same uh, room, but a different angle. And I just love the paneling, the uh, wall moldings. Yeah, um, we'll pop his Instagram on the so screen nice. again. He's the architect and interior designer that we're kind of working yeah. with we on had, our design. We had some comments saying, why are you saying he's an architect when it's more interior design work? But he's also an architect. Both. So he does both. Double whammy, yeah. double trouble, <laughs> double threat. Uh, he's been a legend. We've been talking to him constantly on um, phone calls and text messages and stuff like that. And yeah, we're just excited to get in there, guys. It won't be too long. We'll keep you updated on the vlogs as always. Um, but now it's time to try some ice cream. Some ice creams are like really um, ice, icy, but you know what I mean? Like, this feels so fresh. You know what I mean? When you get them that are a bit older and it's hard to scoot. Yeah. This is like super creamy and we're sticky. I think that's like the best ice cream I've ever had. Are you? No. Really? I'm being serious. The are texture serious? is unbelievable. There's like, pe there's roasted peanut flavors in it, I think oh, they wow. said. It's like this dark, deep chocolate taste. Is, um, it, is it cold? Yeah, obviously. It almost tastes a bit caramelly because of the roasted peanuts. Mm. That is unreal, guys. If you can get your hands on a pint of this. A pint? Is that how much? Yeah, really? it's a pint, yeah. Wow, oh wow, okay, I need to have some of this. Oh my God. Mine's over there. Um, it's really good. I think with that, guys, we're going to end this vlog because I need to go and eat some of the ice cream for myself oh if my it's goodness. that good. Really? Yeah, I'm really okay. surprised. We'll leave the company um, Instagram on the screen. There you go. Go and check them out. Okay, we're gonna end this vlog. We'll see you very, very soon, I'm just guys. Just gonna finish this with a more with another day in the life from ourselves. Thanks for watching all these vlogs. Well, I'm out trying it, but you're on screen. Thanks for right. thanks for watching all these vlogs in our lockdown. We're gonna go for a walk, but thanks for watching. Thanks for spending your day with us again today, and we'll see you very soon in another daily gist. Wait, 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 wait! Just before we go, I d we ended the vlog, but I just tried the ice cream. That's amazing. Lucy is right. That is delicious. Okay, we can go now. Come on.